Hi everyone, Rhonda with Tri Artistry. Thanks for joining me today on my channel. Today's video is going to be working with Artist Loft Ready Mix, uh, pouring paint. And uh, I really have enjoyed working with this paint, so I'd like to do a little bit more of that. And uh, I'm also gonna be working with multiple different techniques. So I'm planning on probably using the balloon. I'm planning on probably using my, um, well, it's not a spatula, but it's like a baster tool. So I'm gonna do that. Um, probably my scraping tool that gives it um, kind of like a teeth scrape look. That's kind of cool. Uh, probably a swiping tool of some type, whether it's a larger one or a smaller one. Um, and then I also have this comb-like tool that I really like. It's, it does a little bit different than, than that one there as well. So those are, yep, those are the tools that I plan on using today as well as the paint, the Ars Loft uh, Ready Mix paint. So I'm gonna get you down on the canvas and get you going on that. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Uh, that way you can get a notification that I have uploaded a new video. I try to upload videos every Tuesday and every Saturday. So hopefully uh, you get to see those if you did that. So thanks. Oh, and don't forget to comment. Tell me about the different things that you've done with maybe this um, material, the Artist Loft Ready Mix pouring uh, paint, or maybe what you've done with a balloon or a spatula or a scraper. I'd really love to know. Uh, I have learned just as much from you guys as you learn from me. So again, thanks for watching me. Let's get you down on the canvas. Bye for right now. Hi, back. Uh, again, Rhonda with Rhonda's Tri Artistry. We are working with these paints. And I wanna do primary colors, although I am adding uh, green and purple in with those three primary colors to get kind of a rainbow effect. I have silver and I also have gold. And then I also have my white and my black over here as well. So I can't wait to get started on that. So let's get you, get all this stuff ready and get you prepped and get you on the canvas. Hi everyone, I'm back. So here we go, we're gonna start pouring and then we'll utilize these fun tools. I'm gonna put the tools off to the side back here with my... <clears throat> so we're gonna go again with our swipe. One side will be black, one side will be white. So um, I'm going to do the colors this way in rainbow style, so. So I said it was a 24 by 30, so the middle should be 15. Up oh, there's 30. So the middle is 15 here. And then the middle, 15. And I just take my level, use it as my straight edge. go there's our middle that'll just help me instead of trying to eyeball it my black and my white will be on either side of that so actually I think maybe I'll do that my black first All right, I'm gonna use this big swiping tool. Check the edges first to make sure that there's no scrapes. And I'm gonna do black first, so.
stopped on me, so I gotta continue. Well, I'm not quite sure on this one, although the last time I did something like this, I wasn't quite sure and I loved how it looked. So I'm gonna give it a two thumbs up and maybe a heart. Depends on how it dries. So I think it is kind of cool to see the black and the white on the side and the different colors. It'll be interesting to see how it comes up, uh, sh how shiny it is and um, what cells end up staying and, and popping through so I think it looks pretty cool so all right talk to you later bye for now Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and comment down below. Tell me what you liked about this, what you'd like to see in the future. And then of course, don't forget to click the notification bell. So that way you can get notifications when I get a new video up. Thanks everyone. Have a great day. Bye for now.